Hello and welcome to the children's time. It is good to be gathered with you. Um, I want to talk today about John the Baptist. This is our third Sunday of Advent and often on this Sunday we um, have a scripture reading that shares about John the Baptist. And so just to remind you, um, John the Baptist was Jesus's cousin and he, in some of the, the gospel writings, they talk about what John was like and what he wore and what he ate. And so you remember he wore clothing, it said that was made of camel's hair, camel hair, and he ate locusts, which is a bug, um, and wild honey. And um, so he's kind of this uh, wild kind of character. And um, he is, he, it's really important to remember that for John the Baptist, um, it wasn't, um, it, it wasn't about him. Everything that he did and his, um, what was important to him, what he felt like God was calling him to do was, had nothing to do with who he was, but it was all about Jesus. And so we have some images from art. So this is um, artists who have painted pictures of John the Baptist. Now we don't know exactly what he looked like, but again, we know some of the things. So you'll see maybe he's got long hair and his cloth clothing is weird because it's made of camel hair. Um, but you'll notice in the pictures that John the Baptist is always pointing so when he's pointing, now I'm, he's, when Jesus is in the painting, he's pointing at Jesus. When Jesus is not in the picture, he's pointing up toward heaven or toward God because Jesus comes from God. Um, and so everything about his life was to point towards Jesus. And now I know that probably somewhere along the way, someone who was helping you to learn manners about things to do and to not do, they told you it's not polite to point, right? But John the Baptist does some pointing and, and it's not, you know, literally, but it is when they painted the pictures, he's literally pointing. So I just wanted to share that with you to think about um, how John, everything was so important for him um, about Jesus and to share with others about Jesus and to kind of lead them to Jesus, to point the way, to find Jesus and um, to get folks ready for Jesus. And, and really that was John's calling, but it's also our calling to think about the things that we do that can point others to Jesus and to direct them or to tell them about Jesus, to show them Jesus, to um, be like Jesus for them or towards them. So John the Baptist is kind of this wild and crazy character that comes into the Christmas story and I like him. I like learning about him and what he shows us and just his passion for Jesus. So I hope you enjoy learning about John the Baptist and think about how you point to Jesus and share Jesus with others. Let's pray together. God, thank you for John the Baptist and what he teaches us about uh, what's important. And what was important for him was Jesus. It was all about Jesus. It was not about John. I am thankful that um, you call us this day to think about what are the ways that we can share Jesus with others or point to Jesus with our lives? And I pray that we take the time to think about that and what are the things that we might do in our circle of family and friends um, and even a wider circle that just continues to share with others that Jesus loves us, that Jesus loves them and to share that light with others. God, I pray that you would bless each child and their home and family, and I give thanks for them. I pray in Jesus' name, amen.